Good day! In this video, we are going to do question 2A part 1 of the 2023 NCA level 3 36 paper called Apply Probability Distribution to Solve Problem. So without further ado, let's do question 2A part 1 in this video and in the two subsequent video, we do part 2 and part 3. So the first question is the inverse Poisson distribution because they asked to calculate the mean and this is a merit question. So let's read the question. So the rate at which the hand lays egg can be modeled by a Poisson distribution. So they tell you it's a Poisson distribution. So we got Poisson distribution. And 99.73% of the time she lays at least one egg each way. So x equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 to n is going to be 0 0.9973 because it says at least one. So include one, one, two, and up to n. Okay. So in, in, when you do inverse Poisson or when they ask you to calculate the mean or uh, mean, so you need to know that you need to get x equal to zero. To get x equal to zero, just take one minus this number here, 0 0.9973, because one to n is 0 0.9973. So zero is the number there. So you take one minus 0 0.9973, and the answer is 0 0.027. So once you know the probability of x to zero is equal to 0 0.0027, we are going to use the inverse Poisson or Poisson formula. So Poisson x equal to x is e minus lambda lambda x over x vectorial. This is given in the formula booklet. So when x equal to zero, we substitute x equal to zero in there. So e minus lambda still stay lambda power zero zero factorial. X factorial is zero factorial. Lambda power zero is one. Zero factorial is also one. So we are left with e minus lambda. So now we got e minus lambda where x equal to zero and it is also equals to 0 0.0027. So we need to take this number is equal to that number because both of them equal to zero. So e minus lambda equal to 0 0.0227. Now what we're going to do if you are doing calculus and you know a bit of algebra, you have to learn both sides to get rid of the e. When you learn both sides, okay, so the minus lambda comes in and ln e becomes 1. So minus lambda equal to ln 0 0.0027. Put in your calculator, ln 0 0.0027 is going to be minus 5.9145. To get your lambda, what you're going to do, you just multiply by negative 1 on both sides. So your lambda equals to 5.9145. And that will give you a solid merit in this question. Inverse Poisson. And hopefully, we'll go through again. Watch it again and make sure you understand how to calculate inverse Poisson. Always, in inverse Poisson, you must make x equal to 0 and use this formula to solve your lambda. So, see you in the next video, which is question 1a part 2. Cheers!